What's up, YouTube model communities and Mo Paul Mike coming from the train room. Look here, I just uh, I got a complete model. I was gonna uh, show you a, a finish um, on that uh, Dodge Dakota for my uh, cousin Alan. Um, pretty good little kit uh, that Lindbergh. Good fit issues, and uh, I'll turn the camera or get the camera focused on it, and then uh, I'll talk a little more about it. Hold on one sec. Well, here it is, fellas. I think it's a 2000 Dodge Dakota. Four-wheel drive. Like I said, I built this for my, my cousin Alan. I give it to him for Christmas. Can't ask for better people. But him and Miss Vicky, his wife. They, that's what they get around in, something similar to that. Like I said, there's some subtle differences. Uh, his is not a four-wheel drive. And his is a four door, or this is just a, a quad cab. But uh, the color's right, and I put a silver stripe like his has got on it. This was a sport truck, and it had red, red uh, grill, it had uh, black bumper, all that. Um, I went ahead and bare metal foiled it, which it turned out okay. Uh, it was a little trying, but uh, not too bad. I had the blacking out part of the window, painted it the windshield with uh, some testers, uh, uh, Creel, Model Masters or Creel testers, whatever it is, uh, acrylic uh, tire black. I uh, went ahead and took the chrome, it had chrome wheels, and I went ahead and de-chromed them and uh, used uh, acryl uh, aluminum to, to spray them. And uh, I'm going to leave some snapshots and stuff of the interior, which it turned out very good. Uh, but uh, all in all, it's a good kit to put together, and uh, cause I built it for my cousin. Uh, just a Christmas gift. I told him I was going to build it for him. I gave it to him at Christmas. And it was a relatively quick kit to build. Uh, I didn't uh, paint the red. I left it the model color and all I done was uh, futured it about five or six coats and um, buffed it out and polished it with some novice. Some more compound. But all in all, it was a pretty good kit. Can't complain. Like I said, it's just a stock truck, and it's a curbside. There wasn't no motor to build in it. Uh, and it's a rolling chassis. I done a little bit of detail work underneath, not a whole lot, a little bit of dust and a little bit of weathering. But uh, yeah, that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, like I said, it's a fun build. And I'm fixing to start on Little Joe uh, Street Outlaw tribute build, uh, community build. So stay tuned for some updates with that. And that's it for now. I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate the uh, new subscribers that came on. Uh, more to marry. I all appreciate it, appreciate it all. Um, like I said, just stay tuned. Y'all take care. Stay safe. And God bless you.